What's up, dude?
Where have you been?
<laughs> Where have you been? Welcome back.
What a workout. I've got to teach those freshmen how to clean up properly. <laughs> hmm? So, I pretended to take a picture with my cell phone. She freaked out and started crying. <laughs> like, it was the end of the world. You should have seen the look on her face. It was priceless. Oh, my God! I have never laughed so hard in all my life. <laughs> They're making fun of someone? Don't they have anything better to do? Huh? Where's that voice coming from? What voice? I don't hear anything. What's wrong, Maki? Maki! Uh, are you okay? Uh, sorry. What were we talking about? About time they left. I can't stand girls like that. That girl in 2E? Yeah, they haven't got a clue. Isn't that bizarre? Man, can you believe these people? So, did you hear the details? Well, a girl from 2E went missing last night. This morning, they found her lying on the ground in front of the school gate. Nobody knows what happened, and supposedly, she's still unconscious. Morning. Yo, you this is a tough case, even for Junpei Iori, ace detective. Ace detective? Are you stupid or something? More like stupe, ace defective. Hey, I resent that. Anyway, where have you been? I was talking to the teacher. That girl they found? I saw her yesterday on my way back from practice. She seemed okay then. Whoa, now that's really strange.
secret time. Have you seen the posts on the student message board? You know how last week that girl was found by the front gate? Well, there's this rumor that it was an angry spirit from this one ghost story. Hey, come on. Nobody believes that stuff. Right? So, what is this ghost story about? What? It's probably made up, so why bother? I'm interested. Go ahead and tell us. Uh... Good evening. Welcome to Junpei's Believe It or Don't. There are many strange things in this world. According to one story, if you get caught at school late at night, You'll be devoured by a maniacal ghost that roams the halls! The other day, this friend of mine, let's call him Shu, he said to me, Junpei, I saw something strange. He sounded serious, so I asked him what he'd seen. He said it was about the girl in 2E. He claims he saw her go into the school on the night of the incident. I couldn't believe it. She's not the kind of girl to be out at night. But Shu was as white as a sheet. He insisted it was true. Then, it hit me. That ghost must have tried to make her its dinner. And that's why they found her lying on the ground by the gate. I felt a chill run down my spine, and I broke into a cold sweat. Yes, there are strange things in this world. Believe it or don't. What do you think, Akihiko? Huh? Not one word about my frankly amazing performance just now? I think it's worth investigating. Wow, I didn't know you were afraid of ghosts, Yukatan. That's kind of funny. Hey, watch it! Fine! Then let's investigate. We'll each ask around for the rest of the week. I'll prove to you that this ghost story is just an urban legend. I appreciate that. The story is a bit unnerving. Huh? Then I'll let you guys handle it. Just make sure you sleep with one eye open. What? Good evening. I came to see you again, as I promised. How are you? I'm glad you remembered me. Now, in another week, the moon will be full again, and the next ordeal will be upon you. So be careful. I'll come again. What's up, dude? me 
Oh, hey! Welcome back. Well, today's Friday. Did you two ask around like we said? Huh? We have something planned for today? Junpei, I told you. I know, I know. I'm just kidding. Man, you have such a short temper. Then we'll meet in the lounge after school. Don't forget. Yes, ma'am. Okay, as we agreed on Monday, we'll now hold a meeting to discuss what we learned. Wow, you're really into this. Of course, I got lots of good info. It turns out, no angry ghost was involved. Oh, so that's what's important. <laughs> First off, let's talk about how this rumor got started. Since the girl was found on school grounds, there's at least one similarity to the ghost story. But why did the rumor spread so fast if this was the first time anything happened? Correct. But yeah, I was surprised when I found out the reason. Over the next few days, there were two more similar incidents. All three victims had to be hospitalized. No wonder people were talking. Next, the victims are in different classes, 
and they don't seem to be connected. However, they did have one thing in common. What was it? What is this, a quiz show? Do you know? Yep, that's right. Not just once or twice, either. They got in with a bad crowd and were always out late. It can't be just a coincidence. So, to find out what happened, we're going to do some field research. Field research? Are you kidding? Yeah. There's this one place where the three victims were regulars. Wait, you're not talking about that place behind Port Island Station, are you? Oh. You're familiar with it. You can't go there. I've heard some nasty rumors about that place. Is that so? Well, then we should all go together. You'll come, right? <laughs> Thanks. Forget it. That place is bad news. I mean, don't you think we're getting in over our heads? Up until now, all we've done is take orders. Does that feel right to you? I know what you mean, but... Man, did you have to say it like that? <sighs> Guess I don't have a choice, do I? Okay. We'll go tomorrow night, then. Right? Let's get going. What's your hurry? I still think this is a bad idea. How could you be afraid of ghosts, but not be scared of this? It's easy to get freaked out by something you can't see. Don't you think? Actually, I'm more worried about things I can see. Like bats and knives. <laughs> Big deal. So it's a little dangerous. Come on, it'll be an adventure. More like a suicide mission. Well, let's just follow Yucatan's lead, I guess. The hell? Check out those rags. They're from Gecko High. Oh, man. This is worse than I thought. Hey, you. I think you're in the wrong place. Uh, well, I... You don't belong here. Get it? Beat it, goatee. Uh, goatee? Oh, you you mean me? We don't need your permission to be here. Hey, 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 are you nuts? Take a look around you. I'm not blind, you know. Come on, don't be intimidated by these scum. What was that? She just called us scum. <laughs> we'll post some pictures that'll make her daddy cry. She'll wish she was never born. <laughs> That's so clever. These guys are the worst. You ought to learn to shut that trap of yours. Man, I feel sorry for you, goatee. This bitch is a pain in the ass. Huh? <laughs> Junpei! That's enough. They didn't know what they were getting into. I'll make sure they leave, all right? Who do you think you are, dumbass? You want some, too? You just crossed the line. You think you're going home alive? Want to give it a try? Uh, uh screw this. <laughs> what a loser. Damn you, Shinjiro. That's right. You're from Gecko High too, aren't you? You better grow eyes in the back of your head. 
Oh man, Senpai, that was awesome! Hey, I remember you. You clowns were in Aki's room at the hospital. You idiots! Get out of here! This place isn't for you. Wait! We came here for a reason! Did Aki tell you to come here? Stupid move. What do you want to know? About that ghost story? Uh, yeah. How'd you know? It's a rumor. Those girls who wound up in the hospital were here talking shit every night about all the things they'd done to some girl named Fuka. Fuka? You mean Fuka Yamagishi from 2E? They were picking on her? That's why people are saying it's Fuka's spirit that did it. Fuka's spirit? Wait, what do you mean by that? You guys don't know? This Fuka girl might be dead. She hasn't been home in over a week. Are you serious? I thought she was out sick, but she's missing? So much for the ghost story. Mr. Ikoda is the homeroom teacher for 2E, right? Does he know about this? I get it, Aki. Still trying to make up for the past. It's you who can't let go. Nothing. That's all I know. Satisfied? Yeah! Thanks, Senpai. Come on, show some appreciation. Don't come around here again. Um, thank you very much. You even gave us a hit. You're very kind. Huh? I, uh, never mind. Don't come here again. <laughs>